y'all know I do not play about my 64 pack with the sharpener in the back, okay? I jumped over the desk for shorty ass. You ain't that bitch that be stuck in the checks. You ain't that bitch that be coming for next. You be that chick that be trying too hard. You be that chick that ain't in so she flex. That's for what's I'm not talking about cash. I'm talking your morals and values and class. You can't be. What's happening, y'all? It's your girl Marie. Welcome back to my channel. Today I got a story time for y'all. This is good. This is hilarious. But if you're new here, go on here, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell, you know what I'm saying? Just so you won't miss out on nothing else I upload. And if you already returning, get your ass in here and sit down. Go on here, grab a seat in the front, get your popcorn ready. It's just about to go down. Okay, okay. So let's hop right into the video. May I remind you, this fight was in kindergarten. I was a youngin', you know. I, I didn't know nothing about fighting, but I knew to stand up for myself. I knew if someone hits you, hit them back. Like, but you know, I just, I'm the type of person throughout my whole life, I've never fought like that. Like, I didn't have my little scuffles, like, Little, little, little fights. Not even nothing major, you know what I'm saying? But overall, I'm a person that I don't go out starting stuff with people. So, you know, I don't, I don't, I don't be on BS. I just be chilling, you know what I'm saying? But that's just me. Let me go ahead and get into this fight. So, I'm still trying to debate if Shorty smacked me and then took my crayon. Or I don't know if she just took my crayon. I don't know because it was so long ago. I'm going to try to do the best I can because this is a funny ass story time. <laughs> Anyways, I think how the situation did go was that... I don't know, Shorty wanted my crayon, and it's like, you know, it's like the 64 pack with the sharpener in the back. It's like 63 other crayons here, like, and then this other kid's using them, so it's like a whole bunch of other crayons said, what you, what you want mad for? Like, girl, bye. Anyways, she, um, I guess, she put hands on me. She smacked, she smacked, she smacked the kid, and I ain't gonna front my mood, she smacked me, bro. And then, and then G my crayon up out of me, like. <laughs> no, son. No, God! I don't care what planet you live on. I don't care how you was raised. I don't care. I don't care about none of that. <laughs> you ain't finna smack me and a gangster me about a crayon, is it? <laughs> so, anyway, that's what she did. Now, mind you, I'm a kid at the time. I didn't know what else to do. All I knew is that I seen red. Next thing you know, I hopped over the desk, like, why you do that? Boom! Oh! 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 Me and her started fighting or whatever. Got some out of outlandish stuff to do, like, oh, let me just, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, damn, like, the teacher was trying to control us. Teacher was trying to grab us. She couldn't get us. She called my brother. Me and my brother was going to the same school at the time. She called him downstairs to come grab me, come calm me down. <sighs> I ran under his leg, right? Around his waist. And I got back to beating the girl, you know what I'm saying? Because I, I was angry, G. I was angry. I was angry, yeah. And then I was even more angry after the fight, you know what I'm saying? Cause we went down to the principal's office. They called my mama. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was finna get a whooping. Like, I don't know why, but I just thought I was finna get a whooping, G. I just. Man, I was crying. I'm like, mama, I'm sorry. I had to do it to her. And my mama told me, like, you ain't in no trouble like shit. Did you win? Did you win? I'm like, yeah, mama, I won, but I hope I'm not in no trouble like she It was so funny. Like, my mama thought, hey, I don't know why I thought I was in trouble, but I got home and got ice cream that day. So it's like, it all worked out. You know what I'm saying? Like, I just wanted to share this story time with y'all because that is a funny story time. Like, it just popped in my head, like, let me do a story time of my first fight. This was my very first fight ever. Like I said, I'm not a confrontational person. I'm chill, laid back. I don't start nothing with nobody. But if you start something with me, I yes, I will and I always finish it. That's just how I am. That's how I was raised. You know what I'm saying? But somehow, people like me who aren't confrontational tend to get in situations where, you know what I'm saying, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta do somebody up. You know what I'm saying? It happens. You win some, you lose some, but you live to fight another day. So, yeah, I had to drop some inspiration on y'all real quick. Thank y'all so much for watching this video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you're not already, follow me on Instagram at it's Marie Love with two E's. It's gonna be right here. It's gonna be right here. Like I'm pointing at it. Magically. Like for real. Like just follow me on Instagram, G, so y'all can stay posted up on what I'm doing, what I'm gonna be uploading soon, what new music is coming. Also, 
You already know who else to follow on the gram, right? LA on the beat. That's right. LA on the beat. It's right here for y'all so y'all can see what's going on with him too. You know what I'm saying? He got a bunch of stuff up on his page. Lots of great content. So go ahead and check him out too. Thank y'all so much for watching this video. I'm going to see y'all later.